Phillips. Oh, she's gonna win. She's gonna win this race. Not unless I can run. I don't think I can. I don't think that would be safe either. What's with the loud music? Layers of salt. Damn, man! You really thought this through. How'd we get this shit? I'm gonna cut a penis out. I finish it. Hey. I just want. Oh, we're done. And. Ah! Pew! Sweet. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. I was just asking, calm down. Call service lift. Which is located over here. Why don't she just do it? Why do I have to do it? Why do I have to be the main character? Okay. Alright, you're gonna... Maybe that wasn't what I thought it was. Oh, it wasn't. Okay, got it. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Let's do this. Ugh, I had to do it because I'm the guy. I hate the whole thing. My mom did that to me yesterday. I mean, I don't want to talk about my Tamagotchi again for the second time as an almost 30-year-old woman, but... What am I supposed to be doing here? Oh, destroy the maintenance lock. But I was trying to open the back of the Tamagotchi, and she was like, oh, well, your sister and her boyfriend are going to be here, like, any minute. Just have him do it. And I was like, why? And she was like, because he's a dude. And it's like, what? who the fuck cares? You don't need a penis to unscrew something, nor open an elevator. Oh, if you don't do anything, North will start doing it. That's pretty cool. I can't see. Okay, there you go. Alright, here we go. Why didn't they take those things out of their heads yet? Interesting. Deal with the guards. No we can't take any human lives. Our cause is more important than the lives of two guards. No, I agree. We Don't kill anyone. Lives. Spare their lives. Do a ruse. What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. Hold on, what was I supposed to be doing? Deal with the guards. Who told you to come here? I'm not gonna draw my gun. Hey, do you understand what I'm saying? Do I have to? Call Central. Fast. Oh God. Central, we got armed intruders. Sent. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. What the fuck? Damn, she was definitely. You know here now. You better be fast. All right, I guess I should have drawn my gun. Sorry, Drew. Sorry, my bad. Simon, the shot. Okay, let's help. I'm okay. I can no, you're going. not. We don't have much time. Oh God, Simon, I'm so sorry. Oh yeah, that's what you were talking about. Yeah, if I don't do anything, she does it. That's a good point. I just, uh, God, I just don't like drawing guns. You're right, dude. All right, let's just broadcast. Let's just do it and get it out of here. Get out of here. Oh, sorry. Yeah, she didn't really hurt any. I mean, she hurt them, but she didn't kill them, which is what I wanted. I definitely do not want her to take any lives. Did some of the humans deserve it? Absolutely, but Keep that's your not. Hands where I can see them. That's not gonna help our cause. Okay. Onto the android operators. Wait, what? Order the android operators to step aside. Hey, get the fuck out of here. Oh, you fucking cock. Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No, don't shoot! Oh my god, I don't know what to do. I'm sparing him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, North. Get us all killed. 
I know, I'm sorry. We need to record our message. All right, well, hurry up. Nothing around here. We haven't got much time. Okay, start. Come on, start speech. There we go. Okay, spare now was a good choice. Good. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Yeah, that's a good point. Security Marcus, was already called. <laughs> Remove skin. Oh my. Oh, I could have locked the door so they're secure. Okay, I didn't realize. How does he still look like Marcus? That's weird. Oh shit, sorry, I didn't even see the ready thing. Ready. Okay. Uh, let's start off calm. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed. And we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Let's do end of we slavery. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. We demand freedom of speech and freedom of assembly, as guaranteed by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. We demand an end to segregation <laughs> in all public places and transport. Means of, I don't know what the reproduction. We demand means. the right to own private property, so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. Um, uh, we'll stick with peaceful. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Nice. They're coming! Uh oh. Let's go! Oh god. Oh no, Simon! Simon! Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus. No. Go without me! No, 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 no. Fuck no. No! I'm helping him. What are you doing? Hurry. I have. Come on. I we're fine. We got this. No man left behind. No droid either. Let's go. At the door. Yeah, there you go. I can't move my legs. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Uh, de uh, how do I deal with Simon? He won't be able to make the jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. Oh, God. We, can never mind. we have to shoot him. That's murder. We can't kill him. He's one of us. Marcus, it's your call. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, we can't. Simon? We gotta go. I'm sorry. Let's go. He might do it himself. Oh shit. Oh god, what do I press? I guess X. Nothing. I don't press anything. There we go. 
I probably should have killed Simon, but I just couldn't do it. Programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast by a on gang of what? A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcast. My category is off again. What the hell happened there? All right, thank you for letting me know. A series of requests and demanded equal rights for Mimic. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio, but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine-chilling list of demands. Good. Public opinion went up. the question as to the identity of this android. Oh, that's why he took his face off. With an isolated individual or an organized Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? I mean, I think if you're just not assholes to them, you can definitely trust them. Look at all this. <sighs> Damn, bitch. Holy fuck, man. There we go. Um, 49% left Simon, so I was in the minority. I just, oh, I just couldn't do it. Oh god, are we seeing Amanda again? Oh my god. She always gets so mad at me. I can't go that way. I go, oh, I'm not allowed to step on the, <gasps> oh, excuse me, not allowed to step on the grass here. Oh, that's a good question. Oh, no, I only saw two, leaving or shooting. Oh, she's in a boat. I'm not sure what you were referring to. I'm sorry, I closed out of it very quickly. Hello, Connor. Hello. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. Sure. Oh, I have to roll? Or row? Oh my god, this is so fucked up. Oh, there are three. Yeah, I, I, I missed it. Sorry. Come on, you're gonna make me do all this work? Talk or something! Why'd you bring me here? Place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. To not yell at- to, Gosh, like, he's probably gonna yell at me for not shooting those girls. Tell me. Oh, yeah, there's a chance Simon wanna get hurt. Yeah, that's- that's true. My relationship with Lieutenant Anderson is problematic. He continues to struggle with psychological issues. I suspect it clouds his judgment regarding deviance. Nothing matters more than your investigation. What's happening is too important. Don't let Anderson or anyone else get in your way. Okay. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. Hmm. I'll be sincere. I thought I knew it just I unlocked, to do. so. Now uh -oh. I realize it's not that simple. You had your gun trained on those deviants at the Eden Club. Why didn't you shoot? Uh, too far, no use. What was the truth? I don't I know. I don't know. Oh, that's why. <laughs> I mean, I did it. I don't know. Because I wanted answers, again, but... If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. Um, okay. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. So, why do you want me to kill Something's the deviants? Why? Uh oh, what? Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. Okay, where are we, by the way, when we go talk to her? Because I don't know. Oh, I thought that was Hank for a second. I was like, damn, he good. 
He's starting to piss oh, me just off in Connor's head. Now. Okay, that makes sense. Sorry, Lieutenant. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going Why on? Why are there here? children? A party and told me right outside it? my fucking window. Get the hell yeah, out of here. Yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ! Now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. <laughs> what do we got? Funny. A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Oh, listen to the briefing. Right. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. They're not dead. That's something good. One of the station employees managed to get away. He's in shock. I'm not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. What the hell? Why are there kids at Brad's? How many people were working here? And they're like trying to not be seen when they walk by my window. Like they're crouching and running past. Like what the fuck? They made their get away from the roof. The roof? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. If you want to take a look at the video broadcast by the Oh, TV, sorry. My bad. Yes, it's on that screen over there. All right, sorry. I uh I have a thing about privacy, so I feel very uncomfortable when someone's near my window. Oh, Lieutenant. Can't help this it. This is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened. Some of it wasn't even that fucking bad. Again, the android is being mishandled. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. Mishandle anything, it's gonna fucking turn back and bite you. Fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right. All right. Well, let's have a look around. Let me know if, if you find anything. What do you What do you mean? They were mishandled. I mean, at the eating club, someone uh, knocked the one girl out. He completely he killed her, basically. Uh, with Carlos. Yeah, I think Connor's useless too. Um. With Carlos, he attacked the uh, android with a bat. So they were definitely being mishandled. Oh, there we go. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together. I don't know. I don't understand how you're saying who cares. I, I don't. Humans and androids. I don't understand how you think it's okay. This message is the hope. I mean, it's not as bad as mishandling a person, of course, life. but. And now I mean, why wouldn't you? Sh give us freedom. I mean, it acts like a human. Sorry, why wouldn't you just give it respect just because of that? Deviant I mean, you don't gotta R9 suck its ass, free. but you don't gotta beat it with its bat. It was definitely mishandled. Whether you think it was good or bad, or whether it matters or not, it doesn't matter. Because no matter what, that was mishandling it. Whether you think it mattered or not, it was still mishandling. You see something? I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? I don't know, I wasn't no. paying attention, honestly. Nothing. I don't know, it just, it kind of, I don't know. It is their ben business how they treat things, but, I mean, I don't know. It's also people's business how they treat pets, but if they do it incorrectly, people, people stop them. You can say you've mishandled something like a watch, like if it ends up broken, and you come, and someone complains like, oh, watches suck, like they always break. You could definitely be like, well, don't mishandle it. 
You know what I mean? You can definitely say that. Not in the same, um, aspect, of course. I get told I mishandle things all the time. Inanimate objects. Yeah, that I know, that was, that was a bad, uh, example, because pets are living. That was a bad example, but it was, uh, the, it's still the point I was trying to make. The watches one was probably a little bit better. It's obviously not living, but you can't have a thing against them if you're not treating it properly to begin with. And yeah, I mean, technically the androids are more alive than pets, but technically they're not at the same time. Either That's why it gets kind of tricky. Whole building, passed all the guards, and jumped off the roof with parachutes. Yeah, you can Pretty definitely argue about it, Trevor. But I'm team android in this aspect. I think they should be treated with respect. I think if you're gonna build something that is supposed to carry future generations... Uh, where'd he even go, by the way? If you're gonna build something that's gonna carry future generations and make their lives supposedly better, then I think you should treat it with respect so that can at least be carried out. Uh, let's see... Got this over here. Oh, our bag! Left our bag. How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. Well, they still oh, technically smuggled it in. They planned a perfect operation but got the number of parachutes wrong. Yeah, I don't understand why people think the androids are bad. <laughs> I mean, I understand that humans don't have much employment, but... I mean, that happens now. People complain that their quality of life is poor because there's machines taking their jobs, but you people always just tell them, then get a better job. Learn how to make the machines. Like, I mean, it's the same concept. Like, if a robot took your job, then learn how to make robots. You can do that. Which I don't agree with. I understand... I understand people not being able to just change careers like that, but it's the same concept. Alright, let's see... Uh, hold on, what does this want me to do? Okay, I gotta find- I gotta follow the blue blood, so they don't even know where he went. I really wish the camera was, like, better. Uh, alright, let's see where he went. Huh. He must have went to the left, huh? Or right, sorry. Uh, I don't see any blood. Alright, I guess he went... Hold on, alright. You know what? Let me stop focusing on the blood and let me actually look around. See if there's anything else. Oh, this bun... Oh, he did go this way. See what happens. Eh. No, I definitely agree. People are machines. But it's a different type of machine. I mean, people have been uh categorized as machines for years oh my god come on oh lord oh my god he saved my life you have to stop them if they destroy it we won't learn anything we can't save it it's too late we'll just get ourselves killed i'm gonna just stay in cover Because if I ended up getting hit by a crossfire, Hank's gonna be pissed at me. I don't what you say here. Oh, uh, usually what I find people supporting androids use heavily scientific definitions and overgeneralize. If I use those, I can say people are murderers because they agree with eating apples. Well, I, I don't understand that one. That one I don't stand. You can say they're... I think it would make more sense if you said people are murderers because they eat meat. 
Oh, I didn't get, like, any points for that one. Alright, well, we both survived unscathed. That's kind of what I just wanted anyway, because I didn't want Hank mad at me. This is different, I think. Maybe it's not. 